Following are four attempts by Wolfgang Schmidt. The first, 64 meters, 4 centimeters. The third, 64 meters, 52 centimeters. Fourth, 62 meters, 8 centimeters. And fifth. 65 meters, 94 centimeters. over on the far side is discus over on the far side and uh, Bugar will obviously want to go just a little bit further to make his position safe bronze medal in the 1978 European uh, Championships the European champion from Athens last year silver medal in the Olympic Games so he's got a fair pedigree and this big check very fast this big check very fast this big check very fast 20 meters behind Imar Bugar of Czechoslovakia. So Bugar leads 67 meters 72. Delis second 67 36. Valent of Czechoslovakia third 66 meters and eight. Now can Delis do the job in the very last throw? The big Cuban has this one chance for gold. The best this season of 71 meters and six. Bronze medalist in the Olympic Games, World Student Games champion, Central American champion, and now can he become world champion on this last throw? Sixty-seven, seventy-two to beat. 
67 72 to beat 67 72 to beat which is why I haven't done a lot of Third final attempt by Evelyn Jarl. She displays a style very much similar to that of Wolfgang Schmidt and some other athletes from the German Democratic Republic.
Evelyn Jarl in her first attempt seen from the ground and from above. 62 meters, 2 centimeters. Third attempt, 65 meters, 74 centimeters. The first attempt of Margarita Dreza as seen by two cameras, 63 meters, 76 centimeters. The fourth attempt, 64 meters, 4 centimeters. Nine meters and 28, uh, went through in 11th place and was very fortunate to qualify. The wind was very difficult uh, in those qualifications, but here, let's see if she can return to a 60 meter four. She was in second place, but the second round, things are warming up. And she really moved across the circle well there, and that's a bigger throw even than her first round. And that looks to be about 60 to 50, and that's a very nice pr uh, throw indeed these world championships it really has been a little bit of a disaster for our field events competitors and Vanessa has 61 meters to exceed to be absolutely sure of getting into the final it really has been a little bit of a disaster for our field events competitors and Vanessa has 61 meters to exceed to be absolutely sure of getting into the final Kevin Cobra of the Soviet Union the world record holder 30-year-old bronze medalist in the European Championships uh, last year. A unique method of uh, starting. But... Uh, she was third in the 1981 World Cup. She's got a personal best of 69.90, but she really hasn't produced much. Uh, so far, and her 69.90 was done this year, so really she should be doing a little bit better than 63.34 in the first round. That looks a bit better. Bronze medalist in the European Championships uh, last year, a unique method of... ...but 70 metre throws this season with a best of 70 metres and 74, so on form. She should go through quite easily. She's all armed for the world's 70 meter throws this season with a best of 70 meters and 74. So on form, she should go through quite easily. As old, holds the world record at 71 meters 80. She's uh, thrown 68.96 this year. But this is the first round. Gisela Bayer leads with 66 meters and 70. As old, holds the world record at 71 meters 80. She's uh, thrown 68.96 this year. But this is the first round. Gisela Bayer leads with 66 meters and 30. So she's certainly capable of the big throw. Doesn't doesn't uh, start right from the back of the circle. It's eight foot two and a half circle. She runs beautifully off the back of the circle, though. And that is, I would think, the leading throw by a fair margin. The big throw doesn't, doesn't uh, start right from the back of the circle. It's eight foot, two and a half circle. She runs. This girl who uh, was third in the 1979 European Junior Championships has a best so far of 66 metres and 84. She's in third place. And... Uh, She's one of the world's 70 meter throwers and would dearly like to get back to that sort of form. Very wide stance and a fast throw and it's going to go. It's a long, long throw. It's way out over 67 meters. In fact, it's a competitor in Montreal in 1976. And that was quite nice. And what, oh, what a comfortable quality.
and competitor in Montreal in 1976. And that was quite nice. Feet so fast that it leaves that arm behind and then lifts. Technically very, very good indeed. Keeps the left foot down too. The, and the end result, 64 metres, three metres more than she actually needed, indeed, and with ease exceeded 61 metres. And that is a nice piece of throwing, and that's well over. Just to indicate that she's done the job. Starts just a little bit round the circle, not immediately at the back, but keeps the left foot down on the ground, which means that she can work against... Oh. And that lacked a little zest, although it seems to have gone quite a long way and it could be about 67 and she could well be in second place with that world record holder set a world record of 71 80 in 1980 richie it's opitz of the german democratic republic from leipzig martina opitz and she's the leader and this throw 67 meters and 76 centimeters third and 67 76 in the fourth and now her fifth round throw she runs so beautifully, and that was very close to a foul, but she's held it in. Oh, it's just short of 70 metres. The student, 68 metres and 74, 25 feet 6. And really is going from strength to strength. She's uh, tremendous movement off the back of the circle. Oh, and that's even closer to the 70 metre line. That's so close to serve to 8 metres and 94 centimetres. As in all. She has yet to get over the 60 meter line. A good technique, it's good and The final result of the high jumping will be qualified. Now shown on the scoreboard A and B. just settling in. Very slow to turn. But it's a pretty active lifestyle.